There we go, finally we're in. I always use that same um that's that same message every time. I every time everyone else has loaded but I haven't. That's what I'm trying to say. Um I will always put just cleaning the crumbs out of my toaster. And then if it lasts exceptionally long, I just say my, my toaster is properly properly just a wash, if that's a word you can use in that context, with crumbs. Like it's it's bad man. My toaster is just not happening. <laughs> Got to, I've got to switch to braces because you know Warburton's is just not working out right now. It's just you know too many, too many, too too sort of brittle in the toaster. You know, too many crumbs, too 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 brittle. Yeah, too many crumbs, too brittle. Go braces, not Warburton's. In actuality, my do my family doesn't eat braces at all. We don't eat braces, bread. It's it's. A bit of Warburton's, a bit of Tesco's finest, you know. It's 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 strange. We we're not lo we're not fiercely loyal. I know I know some people are like fiercely loyal to one uh, bread brand. Oh, didn't know you could get up there. Uh, but uh, we're we 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 don't really do that. We just you know go with the flow. If you want to use that expression, and we just sort of buy whatever. Uh, so there you go. You're welcome, Warburton's. I, I don't specifically have anything against braces spread. It's it's not like I'm going on a hate campaign against it or anything. Great. But uh, there you go. Docks in between the two bombs. But uh, yeah. So I remember once in uh, primary school, braces. Uh, someone from braces bread actually came into our school and uh, did a talk on braces bread. I still, I still, they gave us like free stuff obviously because we're a primary school kids so we get like swept up in that. Um, so we got like a little notebook with a little pencil and a little sticker like I heart braces bread and I still have that stuck on a cabinet in my room. It's, well not a cabinet but like drawers in my room. It's, it's, yeah. <laughs> it's great. Oh, come off it. Yeah, so there you go. My 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 <laughs> little stream ramble about my my life with bread. You are kidding me. Nice good job, dude. <laughs> Starting to worry me there. <laughs> but there you go. So uh Yes, I am a uh, connoisseur of, I guess you could say, all types of bread. Although you, you probably shouldn't say that because I am not, one, I am not a connoisseur. And two, I, I don't do all types of bread, obviously. Like I've said, I don't do braces. We just don't do braces here. So, I'm a connoisseur of select, well, I am a mild critic of select breads. By the way, but Warburton's, um, your your bread isn't actually that crumbly. Like I I don't know. I don't I don't I don't compare it to other brands to be honest in terms of crumbliness. So I wouldn't change your formula just because I've said you know oh it, it's too crummy too crummy if that's say an adjective uh, in the toaster. You know I wouldn't change your formula just because of that. I don't actually know whether maybe Warburton's is like the least crummy of all of the breads to be honest in a toaster. Um, we may never know. I'll do that. I'll test that. Maybe for New Year's video, you know, uh, I'll I'll test that, whether Warburton's is actually more crummy than uh, Braces. Than braces. And Tesco's Finest. We may as well test Tesco's Finest, because, you know... Oh, you're welcome. Uh, yeah, may as well do that. So there. There you go, kids. Uh, this is not a sponsored video, by the way. Sp sponsored stream, I suppose it would be. Although I could make this like a stream highlight, stream ramble, a point, a point on bread in the toaster. Like like a, po a point on the art of reloading a Seirogotti, or the art, or a point on the tone of Battleford One. A point on. Bread. 